Tēnā tātou katoa. I want to acknowledge this wonderful cathedral. I want to thank the faith communities that have brought us together this evening. Acknowledge my fellow candidates. Uh, thank you all for coming out tonight to talk about this incredibly important issue. And, and I want to thank Teresa and Dina and Anna and Karen for the very moving uh, testimony that you gave. I don't think that I need to talk much to you about the housing crisis, because I think that almost everybody here tonight agrees that there is a housing crisis. It's a blight on the lives of too many people in our country, and it's eating away at some of the things that we cherish most about New Zealand. The idea that everybody should have shelter, that decent housing is a human right, that good, affordable housing provides security and opportunity. And the question that we have is how do we fix this thing? The good news is that it is fixable. But we need political will. We need courage and sustained reform. And we need to reject the tired failed neoliberal policies that got us into this mess in the first place. <clears throat> when we change the government in September, we're going to do the following things. We're going to get the government back into the business of building affordable homes for young Kiwi families. It's an echo of policies that for decades in this country helped young families into their first homes. That's what governments should do, and that's what we will do. Our KiwiBuild policy will provide affordable first homes for 100,000 young families over 10 years. We're going to tax speculators. If we don't deal with the property speculation that has become a mania in this country, we will never be able to build our way out of this housing crisis. So we're going to close the loopholes that currently subsidise property speculation and disadvantage first home buyers. We're going to change the law so that if you sell a rental property within five years, you will pay income tax on the capital gain. It's the right thing to do. We're going to rewrite the rules for renting, Karen. Half the population in this country are renters. And yet this country gives fewer rights than almost any other country in the Western world to renters. Under our government, renters will have more security of tenure. It's not OK that you can be kicked out in 90 days for no reason. We're going to change the law so that renters have the right to own a pet, put up a shelf or paint a wall as long as they return the property to the state it was in when they took on the tenancy. That's how they do it in Germany and most European countries. Why not do it here? I want to talk about state housing. Because the current government believes that state housing is some old-fashioned thing from the 1930s that we don't need anymore. And they want someone else to do it. They want the churches to do it. They want the private sector to do it. The Labour Party believes that state housing is as needed and relevant now as it has been at any time since the days of Michael Joseph Savage. We are going to stop the sell-off of state housing and build thousands of extra state houses. Under our government, Housing New Zealand will be run as a public service, not used as a cash cow. We're going to bring back the functions from um, WINS and MB and restore Housing New Zealand as a public service with one job, and that's to put a roof over the heads of people who need it. I promise to you tonight that our government will make a commitment to end homelessness. We will work with the community 
We will work with everybody who wants to work with us to develop a New Zealand strategy to end homelessness. I know that we can do these things. Our parents and grandparents fixed these problems. There are lots of countries overseas that simply don't have the out of control property speculation, skyrocketing house prices, plummeting home ownership and record levels of homelessness. I know that we can fix these things. But you need to choose decisively change next month. If you want to fix the housing crisis, party, vote, Labour for a progressive, reforming, social democratic government that will work to fix the housing crisis. Do it for your children, your grandchildren, and do it for our country. Thank you.